Hey guys, my name is Ryan. Welcome to your Supply Hub. So I'm going to give you a little bit of information about this product and why we think it's such a great solution for any business. So your um, first line of defense after PPE is temperature scanning. Even though they find it to be re relatively ineffective, it is one pre um, preventative measure that you can implement in your business that seems to be really working for other customers. So when you're putting a employee scanning temperatures at the door, um, you're going to have to pay that employee at least minimum wage and then chances are you're going to have to pay them hazard pay on top of that since you're putting them in a hazardous in, uh, work environment. So you can be looking at anywhere between $10 and $15 an hour. So if you pay one employee $10 an hour for a week, right, that's $400 a week. If you pay them hazard pay for a week, that's $600 per week at $15 per hour. So let's go ahead and do some simple math, right? If you're paying somebody $15 an hour for a week, right, at 40 hours a week, that's $600. In a month, that's $2,400. That person that's checking temperatures, that should be their only job because they potentially could be contaminated and carrying around germs on their clothing, on their gloves, on their PPE. So not only do they need to be really actually changing their PPE every time they come into contact with one customer, they're not really safe to bring them and let them walk around your business in between checking temperatures of customers and, you know, in the lobby and break rooms where they could potentially be spreading those germs to other um, employees or customers. So the safest way to do that would be just to have one employee at the door 24 seven doing nothing but checking temperatures. So this device will pay for itself in the first 30 to 45 days of being used. The one thing I will say about the coronavirus is it doesn't really give you much opportunity to um, take chances or make mistakes, right? Um, we can all see by Tyson and these meat packing factories that chose to not provide PPE to their employees. They chose to not make special precautionary measures like this and you've seen their doors get shut down you see them lose millions of dollars and not only that if at this point if you're not providing ppe and setting these preventative measures in place to keep your employees safe and healthy and you do get infected cases in your business and your doors do get shut down there's a very good chance that the media is going to pick up on that and then your business is going to have that same stigma that tyson has right now where they chose to put money in front of the health and safety of their employees. So yes, this unit's gonna cost you anywhere between $1,500 and $2,500. So now let's add in the factor of what it would cost you if you had to shut your doors down for a week. Not just shut your doors down for a week, but you'd have to bring in a hazmat team or a specialized company to come in and fog and disinfect your entire business, right? That would require a lot of money. They charge 75 cents per square foot to fog. You have to have your business ready for them to fog, meaning you have to remove all electronic equipment, turn off all power, yada, yada, yada. Anything that's electronic that can get wet and damaged has to be removed from the building. That means you have to pay another team or yourself to actually sanitize all of your electronical equipment, all your mouses, keyboards, computers, tablets, phones, the whole nine yards. So this device will save you money not paying an employee at the front door. It'll save you money not paying for a PPE for that employee working at the front door. And even if this device prevents one sick customer from coming into your business, that one sick customer could potentially infect your entire staff, including yourself, and the medical bills and lost wages and all the issues that, and headaches that are going to come along with that. It's just not worth it. This is just a simple, easy, you know, preventative measure that's at this point almost impossible to keep your business open and running without.